after downloading the pro version you just need to install it mm, the free version will automatically deactivate uh, then you just need to go to the um, ca7 date time this is the option where you control all the things uh, i have opened it here um, like currently you see the yeah, all all the options are uh, in the free version like um, let's see the uh, pro version option um, first option is dark mode uh, let's save it you see the red time pick up become dark darker uh, now let's say uh, you want to disable the uh, date uh, prior to today um, you can disable disable before today save it um, now you just can select previous date you see uh, they can select from today you can disable today you can change the date format uh, just keep it there you see all um, <coughs> today and prior today is disabled user can uh, select only from tomorrow Uh, you can uh, select um, your uh, week start like here is Sunday I can start it uh, Saturday you can add week to disable the weekend and let's say your week start uh, from Saturday to select it you see it is start from sunday uh, let's uh, just refresh the page it start from saturday now you see uh, you can disable uh, weekend if you don't want user to say uh, like let's say uh, sunday and saturday is our weekend uh, this is saturday Sorry, means six, and we want to disable the weekend. Let's refresh the page. Now, weekend will be disabled. You see, Saturday, Sunday disabled. This will also work here. Saturday, Sunday disabled. Okay. you can uh, disable a specific date like if you uh, want to go to on a holiday or something uh, you can put the date here and that date will be disable too uh, the date format must be similar to uh, this format like if you select this year month date then you have to put year month date if you select day month year then you have to put day month year okay i'm just skipping this option right now uh, this option uh, let's say you want your user to select um, maximum one month if you want to disable date one uh, one month from today you can do that you just put 30 uh, user won't be able to select date uh, beyond 30 uh, days from today if you want to put if you uh, uh, put 7 user won't be able to select days uh, after 7 days from today uh, uh, this uh, let's save this
just start let pick a you see this date sh should be selectable but now it is disabled because uh, you disabled seven days prior to today uh, you can um, select two hour or tw 12 hour format or 24 hour format uh, like here currently time format is 24 hour you can select 12 hour you can show am or pm my am pm format like uh, let's select this one yes see time picker and it is now um, to a power for format and let's say um, minimum selectable time let's say your office is start from 9 uh, am to 5 pm uh, <coughs> you can select nine am <coughs> five means seventeen here you have to put the time in twenty four hour format not twelve hour format let's save it uh, you see the previously time loading from twelve am like night midnight 12 am let let's refresh the page i see time picker got 9 am to 5 pm as another um option for time another option is this type uh, you see that time step is 15 13 45 you can change that uh, default is 15 let's say you said 10 okay uh, default time is the time uh, it will highlight okay let's save it uh, refresh it refresh the page you see time step is now 10 Okay. Here also it will change. Uh, another thing is the um, load script. Like uh, you don't need to load uh, the CSS Java script related to the uh, date time. All the pages. Like if you want to load this script to only this page. Uh, for the page speed uh, for perform performance of the website or uh, you can select multiple page uh, go to the edit of this page then you see the page id here two three zero zero just copy that put it here if you want to load this script in multiple pages then you can separate the pages with comma and put the number here okay just save it and css will be loaded only this page now css javascript and related things